This is Jeff from the Watkins Tree Farm. How are you guys? Welcome back to the channel. And today we are going to start phase two on the walking bridge. And before I get too far on anything, I've been wondering if this uh, 1026R will lift the walking bridge. We just went through the polar vortex. I think it got down to, well, one night it got down to negative 14, negative 15. Today's supposed to be 40, something like that, but we're, the south wind's back. The old Kansas wind is back. I was looking at the tractor and noticed some water, some antifreeze on top of the engine where the hose goes into the engine. I'm hoping it's just a hose clamp and I can tighten it. Otherwise, I've got other issues. So I'm going to do that right now. So it looks like this hose clamp is loose, so hopefully I can tighten it and it quits leaking. So what I'm doing right now is, before I'm going to attempt to lift this up, I'm going to put some cross supports in there. They're about 19 and 7 eighths. Seven eighths. That's what I'm going to do right now.
we got it moved. I think that went pretty smooth. It didn't go exactly as I first thought, but we rolled with it and it worked out. We stayed safe and I think it turned out well and I think it looks awesome. I can't wait till it's set in place. So right now I'm gonna go build the boxes or the forms for the concrete. And then once we get those built, we'll put them down on the ground. We'll level everything out, mix some concrete up and get this thing ready to set. simple I'm gonna do five foot wide and then two foot so five by two and so I can take a ten foot two by four cut it in half and there's my five foot and then I'll take an eight foot two by four and uh, cut it four ways and I'll get my two feet
pouring concrete is just uh, unlike anything else. Once you get started, you're on a timeline and you're just kind of running around and uh, hoping you hit the record button and all that. I think it turned out well. Uh, let it set up and then tomorrow I'll pour the next pad. I'm about too short on the uh, concrete bags. This took a little bit more than I thought, so I'll have to run to town and get some more concrete bags, and we'll do that one tomorrow. Uh, it's uh, 66 degrees today. The Kansas wind is back. Tomorrow's supposed to be 70. I don't think as much wind, so it should be a little better. I think this turned out well. We'll move on to the next one. Hey guys, I just want to say thank you for watching my content and uh, just uh, tuning in and uh, caring what I'm doing out here. And if you like this content and you like what we're doing out here at the Watkins Tree Farm, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, it'll help us out. Awesome guys, we got it set on these concrete pads and man, do a little landscaping and this is gonna look awesome. So anyway, I've got a little bit to do. We got the handrails, we gotta actually secure it to the concrete pads, but that's another day. I thank you guys for tuning into the video. Uh, hey, if you like it, hit that like button and we ask for your subscription, follow along on a Watkins Tree Farm. <laughs> And we thank you very much, guys. You guys take care. God bless. And we'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.